What's up guys, hey Anthony here at InGear and today we have another awesome build from KBO. We have the Ranger in orange and it looks awesome. So we wanna give you our first impressions. Here they are. Bro, oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> it's so bad. It's so bad. Oh. Dude, it's making me nauseous, dude, honestly. I don't, <laughs> I can't even focus, dude. Honestly, <laughs> honestly I might puke. <laughs> Sponsored by Kavita. Honestly, I wish, because I love Kavita. Kavita, if you want to sponsor this video, you're helping out a handicapped kid. Look it, it's my cozy. Just put that in here. <laughs> The boot. I drink the beer from the glass, but that's boring. That's boots. Ooh, yeah, that's more like it. The boot, the like German boot, the Kavita leg. <laughs> all right, so we're going to start by working our way from the top of the bike and go all the way down. One of the things I want to mention is that if you buy this bike right now at $16.99, which is an incredible price for a cargo bike, it comes literally with every feature that you see. It comes with the front rack, it comes with the side racks, it comes with the top rack. Awesome features that come stock. A lot of times when other companies sell you a bike, they sell it with all sorts of accessories. So KBO, thanks for including all of this stuff in the purchase price. All right, here we go. All right, so we got the fat tires, which I really like because this is a cargo bike. It's nice to be able to feel really secure and low to the ground uh, with these big beefy tires. Right up here, we have the front headlight, which mounts to the rack, or if you decide to take off the rack, it'll mount right to the front of the bike. Uh, cool feature that they thought this through of mounting it right into the front of the rack. Um, pretty standard, you have your uh, Shimano gears, you have a trigger bell. One of the things I do like about this is that they have these hand paddles that are a nice leather material. Um, and on your Tektro uh, brakes, it has this nice rubber grip for where your fingers uh, meet that. Awesome display, solid display. It's really big, it's clear, uh, and it has this nice silver that goes around it. Very simple controls, which I also like because it's not overcomplicated. Now the battery section is really beefy, as you can see. You have the key port right here. And one of the interesting things is that the, the battery itself has a lever that drops out right here on the bottom. So your battery actually is um, fed through the bottom, which is unique clicks right in, automatically locks. You can double lock it by using the key system. Um, really great feature. It's a large 48 volt battery, which is awesome because it will power this for quite some time. Uh, work our way down into an adjustable seat. Um, adjustable seat clamp gives you some serious height. So if you're a taller rider and you need a really tall seat, or if you're a really small rider and you want to adjust it, makes it super simple. Now let's get into the most interesting part of the bike is the back end of it. Uh, one of the things you'll be seeing up in one of our next videos is they actually make uh, a child seat that actually mounts to the back of this. So let's say you got a little kiddo, uh, toddler-ish age, where they don't feel confident being able to just sit here right behind you, maybe grab your waist, maybe grab these things, where you wanna strap your kiddo in, they make a seat attachment that does that, and it's gonna be awesome. So the whole back end is really cool, but you can use this for cargo storage, you could have a second passenger ride and put their feet there because this bike has a payload capacity of 400 pounds, which is 100 pound uh, over what the other KBO models have. So this is a really hardy bike. As you can see, it's very beefy. Uh, it has a 750 watt motor and it's awesome. I encourage you to get on one of these. So if you're interested in trying out one of these bikes, you can order one at KBO or click the link below. That certainly helps us out and we will see you in the next video. Oh, freaking handicap problems. Can't even wear regular shorts. <laughs>